there. I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm thrilled to be here with you. And I do mean thrilled. Alan and I have lived in our new home, our dream home, which needed a lot of remodeling. We have lived here for eight weeks now. We moved in May 5th and now it is the 4th of July today. It is about 11 o'clock on the 4th of July and I'm talking with all of you. And I am thrilled with the progress on our home recently primarily in the last two weeks. The first six weeks went very slowly and it was really hard to get through. Some of our contractors didn't show up sometimes for weeks at a time. It was very challenging. But in the last two weeks, our contractors have been fabulous and they have showed up and put in wonderful full days and gotten lots done. And I did want to tell you this is not a sponsored video and I'm paying, of course, for all of my home repairs, my home remodeling out of my own pocket. But I do want to recognize excellent work because I think it is so important to reward talent and to give good recommendations for contractors here in Wichita, Kansas. And the first contractor that you'll come into contact with in the remodeling is my hardwood floor installer and my new hardwood floors look beautiful. They're not totally finished as of this video, but you'll see them in a finished state in a few weeks after the painting is done. But I am using a contractor called Absolute Hardwood Floors and they came very highly recommended from my realtor. She said they were the absolute best in town and very reasonable and she was right on both counts. And Mike Ranger is president of Absolute Hardwood Floors. You'll see him briefly in the video, but you'll see his great work, which is just wonderful. And also I would like to mention Wichita Granite. And they installed all of the quartz countertops in my home. Alan and I have worked with Wichita Granite for about the past 10 years, 15 years, somewhere in there, maybe about 10 years in our own personal residences, in lots of rental houses and flips and that kind of thing. They are absolutely a quality company. They have a wonderful selection of granite in quartz and they are really quality in terms of the installation. Both of these companies are very much attentive to the details and they really work hard to give you a wonderful end result. And both of these contractors are here in Wichita, Kansas. So anyway, let me get down to business and show you the progress we've had on our home remodel in the past two weeks. I'm gonna go check it out, see how far they've gone. Oh my. Let's check it out from this side. Woo! Oh wow! Cool. We are walking on wood floors, baby! Wood oh, floors! Cool. This is Dylan's room, which is their little office. We're not using it as an office, we're gonna use it as a living room. Oh wow, it's almost done. That. that looks good! What do you think, honey? Is that great? Wonderful, isn't it? He won't speak. In a few words. Okay, it is a little later the same day, and I decided to go upstairs and see what's going on. So here we go. Fingers crossed. Yeah, that's cool. It's really coming along. Wow. Looks great. Making a little progress. Yeah, you're coming together fast. Okay, I know my hair looks terrible. It's looked terrible all day. But I'm so excited because Alan is about to open the front door and we're going to see the wood from the front side, which should be really fun. It's opening the door. Oh my gosh! We have a wood floor. Oh my gosh. We have a floor to step on. Oh, that's where the dining room table will be. Oh my gosh. Our house really is going to be at home. Yay. Hey, this is the bathroom. And again, I have a beautiful new ceiling. And Brian came in and worked a long time yesterday and he got me these little trim mold boxes and he put some of the, some of the baseboard along there. Um, he's gonna wait on that for some reason, I can't remember why. But he also got crayon molding in the bathroom. It's not real wide, it's like three and a half inches. It's not as wide as what's out in the other part of the house but this is a very small room and I think it'll just be a nice little accent up there of something a little different from the wall or the ceiling. So anyway, my bathroom is starting to look like it is going to come together after all, which is just wonderful. Oh, the master bedroom. Oh, I love 
Master. Thank you so much. It looks great. <laughs> and you know what I was so surprised at is, you know, my last contractor left a bunch of trash in the living room. You guys don't like that, do you? No. No, we clean up every day. Usually they're cleaner after we show up and, and you know, beforehand. My house is, because yeah. you cleaned up after the last contract. Yeah, and then we'll clean up after ourselves every day. Yeah. So we don't we don't want to leave a mess, especially if somebody's living here. If you gutted it and weren't staying here, that would be different. You want to come up there and walk around at night and not step on nails and well, know, kick it, dirt around. And yeah, all that. well, and I appreciate that you're coming this weekend. Do you work a lot of weekends? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're super busy. It's, we're the only crew. Wow. It's just one of the trades where somebody will do it for a couple of years and they think they know enough to go start their own company. Yes. And they usually fail. Yeah. Know? I mean, that's well, how it goes. I used a no-name company at my last house and we got halfway through the job and I had to change it out to a different company. It was a bad, bad, bad experience. Yeah. They installed the wrong kind of wood. Oh, they installed yeah. red oak instead of white oak. Ooh. And, oh, it was terrible. Yeah. So, and they could probably get there right away. You probably didn't have to wait for them. Exactly. Yeah. Whereas you guys, you take a little time to get into Yeah, we're a little tough to get to. Yes. <laughs> but we're so busy. Oh, my gosh. Cool. Oh, gosh. The first countertop is the bathroom. How exciting! That looks great. Oh, look at the master bedroom. It's almost done. Yay! We have a floor. I could like cry. This is the bathroom. Oh my gosh! Thank you. Oh my gosh! We have countertops. Oh my! I am so happy. Oh my! I am so happy. Look at that. And the countertops are quartz and all of this will be painted white the cabinets will be painted white oh my i love that they're kind of an off-white color which is perfect for the white paint that will be coming in and these are some boxes that brian the carpenter did yesterday yay it's really coming along get the sinks in There's one of the sinks. Pretty exciting. It's going to be undermount. Needs to be undermounted. <laughs> Look at this. This is the new island with the quartz on it. I love it. And look at my wood floor. It is really making great strides today. It's crazy. No quartz yet in the kitchen, but I'm so excited to see that island. Pretty exciting. Yay! Here is the coffee bar, and there's the kitchen, and they're still working on the kitchen. I just started the kitchen, but here is the laundry room, and it has its granite in, and it will have an undermount sink there, but I really like that. And then here are the Jack and Jill bedrooms, the two bedrooms at the end of the house. And let me see if we have a light here. Okay, there is one quartz countertop, and there is the second quartz countertop. Yay! Hey, here's the kitchen all installed. Pretty exciting. There's a look at the Hi, it looks so great. I'm so happy. It's beautiful. Are you showing me the seams? Over here. Oh, you can't even see that seam. Where is it? Oh my gosh, it's right here? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, my okay. gosh. That is amazing. Good job. How do you get it so smooth? <laughs> yeah, we we try, we try. Amazing. And they have a seam here, and you can hardly see it either. I mean, maybe a little bit. Well, hardly at all. That looks so great. Those are my new sinks, too. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. It looks awesome. They are in the kitchen on a Saturday morning, putting the final touches on our floors. I'm so excited. I sneak in there and try not to bother them. Maybe they won't see me. I want 
to tell you I'm so happy. I'm so happy looking at my new countertops. I'm so happy looking at my new wood floors. I'm so happy that this house is going to come together. This is the first time I've really believed it and I'm so happy. Hey, I am looking in the front door. Here's the front door. And I can smell the stain. They have stained it. But boy, that is really, really, really a light color. But you know, I bet it will be pretty once it is, you know, once it has a finish on it. And I like a satin finish. I like a little bit of a shine. But my, that is really, really, really light. I had no idea it would be. Okay, here is a look at the floor at this point. And basically it has had the stain on it and one coat of sealer. It still needs to be sanded and sealed, I think two more times. But this is the point at which it will rest until the paint job is done on the walls and on the trim. And that starts next week, which is really exciting. And today, Brian, my carpenter, who has, you know, taken his time to get here a lot of the time, I'm so excited because supposedly today he is going to come and finish up some carpentry work just prior to the painters coming. But here is a look at the floor, and I think it looks just beautiful. And this does not have the final coat of finish again. And I will be going in with a satin finish because I do like a little bit of shine on the floor. This is the little Dylan room, I call it, because my son Dylan loves reading and libraries. And this is again the great room. And here is the hallway to the master, or I guess the primary bedroom. That bedroom, I call it the mini bedroom, will get carpet. But here is the wood into the primary bedroom. And I think this floor is just absolutely gorgeous. I am so excited about this. And there is the master bath at this point. It has no lighting in it at all, so it's very hard to see. But they did drag the tub in earlier, and it was beautiful. I'm so excited about that. A lot left to do, but I really think that in about six weeks, I should be finished. And sorry, you can hear my slippers hitting my heels because we're not allowed to walk on this in bare feet at this point. We have to have shoes on. And this is the little eating area in the kitchen that will get a new light there. Here is the new quartz, which I'm so excited about. Brian will be working on this today. He brought down the top of the bar to a lower point to where it opened it up to both rooms. And so he will be modifying this lower edge here. Here is the rest of the kitchen. There will be a center island here, dishwasher there, but there is my quartz. Oh, I'm so excited. There's my coffee bar, very exciting. And here is the wood floor. That leads to the basement. And this leads to the powder bath. It's very dusty here. Whoops, <laughs> but isn't that great? Brian did that the other day. I'm so excited. And then if we follow this hallway, we come upon the laundry room. And I did decide to go quartz in there. And then I'm back to the two little little bedrooms back here. They're, they're not really little, but they are two bedrooms that are, I guess, guest rooms. So anyway, that's where we are today. I am so excited to be seeing some real miserable change. And let me know in the comments section if you'd like to see the progress on the new paint job, which is coming up this next week. Well, that is a look at the beginnings of our whole house remodel. I really think that in about six weeks, we'll be finished with the first floor and able to move out of the basement. We're living in the basement, able to move out of the basement and into the first floor. And then we will be having the basement remodeled, but that should take a lot less time. So I'm really looking forward to getting to that point. And if you have tips on remodeling, tips on hardwood floors, countertops, quartz, granite, any remodeling tips at all, I hope you'll share the information in the comments section below the video because that way we can help each other, which is always great. Well, on that note, I'll leave you all to your day. Let's both make it a great day and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.